This intrepid group of goose banders is working the snow goose population of Baffin Island, around 1,500 miles northeast of North Dakota. A long way to go to ban geese, but well worth the effort. We get information about migration, about their survival rates, about the rates at which they're harvested. Among the banding crew is Mike Johnson, a retired waterfowl biologist from the North Dakota Game and Fish Department. He can't seem to keep away from his lifelong passion. Only now it's a hobby instead of a job. And Johnson knows the importance of the work being done here. This is a tremendous area and the chance to see the uh, largest uh, snow goose breeding colony in the world. Just how big is the breeding colony at Baffin Island? Well, real big. It's home to, our latest estimate is uh, upwards of 2.5 million nesting lesser snow geese. The group scheduled its banding operation to coincide with the growth of the goslings and their ability to be banded. But any time you're operating that far north, weather will play a part in your plans. We're transported out here by Twin Otter and it was the weather made it impossible for us to get the camp on schedule. The banders didn't let that small weather setback interfere with their project. They were still able to get enough birds banded to collect the data they need to better manage the resource. We obtain information from hunters who recover the individually numbered bands from the birds and report them. If you happen to harvest a snow goose with a band this waterfowl hunting season, make sure to report it to the number listed on the band. This is Tom Jensen, Outdoors.